this evening. All right, all right. It gives me a great pleasure to once again welcome all of you to Green Amaze. And I'd like to take this opportunity and invite the family members. I'll share the cake. So requesting the family of Rox, uh, his brother Rizwan and his wife Sharon, along with his sister Rollin and Alec, her husband. Requesting the parents of Linoshka, uh, Ms. Bhati De Silva and uh, Loretta De Silva to join us over here as well. Ladies and gentlemen, while the family is coming in, let me take this opportunity and introduce the entire bridal entourage. Look at them looking so smart and sexy out there. All right, let me introduce all of them. First up, I have the lovely and beautiful flower girls, Loshki and Anaya. Girls, can you wave to everyone? That's right. People, can you wave back to the pretty girls? That's much better. All right, okay. We have our page boy, Jordan, as well. And we have the beautiful ladies, the bridesmaids out here. And let me introduce to them. Let me introduce you to all of them. We've got Kimberly, Leticia, Delora. Ladies, please wave to everyone. Come on. Come on, people. You can put your hands together for them. That's right. Okay. All right. And we have the dashing groomsmen out there with their bow ties and suspenders. Alan, Darren, and Shula. Guys, fist pump. Fist pump. Come on. Give us all a fist pump. That's much better. All right, good job. Okay, so we've got the entire family out here. The photographers and the paparazzi for this evening. If you'd like to take a picture, now is the time when you can do so. I think we've got that. Okay, all right. Ladies and gentlemen, Rox and Anoshka, their story is that of a fairy tale. Eight years ago, long time, right? Well, eight years ago, in a cinema theater not far from here, a young nervous girl was waiting, waiting for her date. Now her date, unfortunately, was a little late. And what did he have to show for all of that? Well, you just have to look at him and see at his big smile on his face. Well, immediately there was a connect. Well, Linoshka was a little upset, you can gather. But Rox, as usual, smiled his way to her heart. Eight years later, here we are. When I met the two of you, if you remember very carefully, I asked you something. I said, I want both of you to tell me what makes you tick as a couple. Why do you think they are meant to be with each other? Now, Nashka started giving me a lot of answers. I said, wait, 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 wait. I want to hear the bashful, shy young man next to you. And he gave me that characteristic smile of his, that 100 watt smile. Look at it. It's beautiful. And immediately I said, well, okay, I'll tell you what. Why don't both of you send me your answers individually? And tonight, I'm going to reveal those answers. Don't worry. I think you two are meant to be. Let me start with you. What is Lenoshka to you? Well, Lenoshka, you should know this. He says, you have filled him with so much love that he has never known before. He says, you are the yin to his yang. The thing that makes him complete. The love that he has not felt, he says, in a long time. And he says he's going to feel it forever. Linoshka messaged me her answer. I will just get to the gist of it. Well, she says, Rox completes me as well. He is the yin to my yang, the calm to my excited storm. We balance each other out. When he wanted cakes, I learned to bake. When I wanted to dance, he learned to dance. And together, they are here. Trust me, eight years is a significant amount of time. And I was wondering, after eight years, what could be the significance of this date, 20th of Feb? What could be the answer? And while I thought and thought and thought, I went online as well, a few immaterial things which I came across. And then I realized, well, well, to each and every one of you standing out here, 20th of Feb may not mean so much. 
But to those two people out there, this is going to be the day where the rest of their lives begin. This is going to be the day where they tell their children, their grandchildren, their great-grandchildren, this was the day when all of you were possible. Ladies and gentlemen, if we are to make this night special for them, I request each and every one of you to take a small promise with me. All of you out here need to promise me just one thing. You guys need to make sure that they have the best night of their life. Can you promise me? Yes. I need a resounding yes. Can you promise me? Yes. yes. All right. So let's get this party on the road. Rox, pick up the knife. That's right. With your other hand, please hold the Nashka. Pull her closer. Yeah, she's your wife now. You can do that. All right. Great job. Okay. On the count of three, we're going to cut that beautiful cake. Three. Two, one, go for it! Congratulations, that celebration. We want to know you know we're happy as we All the very best. Three, two, one, cheers! Whoa. Are you ready to enjoy yourselves? Uh, are you ready to enjoy yourselves? All right, much better. All right, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be kickstarting off this evening extremely soon. But, 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 but. You gotta wait for some time because in all this excitement, I almost forgot that the bride and groom, they have to talk. So, Rox, Noshka, I will now hand over the mic to the two of you. First thing, I'll go to my dad and say, okay, I need some new wedding advice. And he'll be like, okay, what do you want this time? I said, okay, it's a love. the couple is really nice. I said, okay, I asked him a question. Could you tell me what makes your marriage tick? You spent 25 years with my mother. Some, some, some secret must be there. He said, it's very simple. The Zalra, it's very simple. It's it's easy. I said, how, how do you manage it? So many quarrels and issues and stuff. How do you manage? He said, it's very simple. I said, okay, I must know the secret to this. He says, at the end of every argument, all I do is say, yes, dear. And at the end of it, it's a happy married life. So ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of everyone out here, it's time to wish this bridal couple a happy married life. And let's have some fun tonight. Let's clear up the table and let's get set to kickstart off this party. True Blue, ladies and gentlemen, are going to be kicking off this party for all of us. I request you to stay on the dance floor. Do not run away anywhere. All right? Do not go anywhere. I can see a few of you running away. No, no, no. Please stick around. Grab a partner. Could be anyone. Just grab a partner and join us in the bridal march. All right, Zubin, 
Are you ready? Okay, take it away, man. <laughs>